Concerns over an attempted kidnapping at a popular Sacramento park tonight. I already have trust issues as it is, you know, so you don't know who's around you and what they're thinking. Police say a man tried to take off with a young girl after striking up a conversation with her father. This was at a park on 16th and C Street in broad daylight. And new tonight, CBS 13's Jennifer McGraw was at the park earlier this evening and spoke to parents about this terrifying ordeal. The park on C Street is a kid's fan favorite because it has just about everything. He loves it. As it turns out, it also now has a growing concern after hearing a man trying to kidnap a three year old girl in front of her father. Oh my God, that happened here? I already have trust issues as it is, you know, so you don't know who's around you and what they're thinking. Corey Ridgeway says he would react much like any father who put his daughter in danger. I'll probably lose my head. Too. So, I mean, I'm happy nothing happened to the child and the child is safe. The father was successfully able to fight off the attacker. Police say kidnapping attempts by strangers is rare in Sacramento. This is somebody that was either uh, very highly motivated to engage in, in the behavior that they were taking part in, uh, or perhaps uh, their, their mental clarity was being impacted by. Uh, some sort of impairment. Police say the suspect, who may have been a transient, had a brief conversation with the father and then tried to grab the girl. He immediately engaged this person, and a physical fight did take place between the father. Uh, and this man. The attack happened in a tot lot, which is designed for kids. Under city law, only adults with children are allowed in the area. I don't trust anyone who doesn't come in here with a kid. If you're at the court playing basketball, then you go to the basketball court. But if you're standing here by yourself looking at kids playing, I think you're, you're suspect. Still, parents are on edge knowing that this suspect is still out there. It's definitely, like you said, not some place I would come by myself because it's not safe.